Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your girl, Alondria, back with another video, and I didn't really have room to do the intro part, so you're going to have a black background with probably an emoji. I don't know. You'll see when I figure it out. But in this video, I'm going to be doing the meal prep recipe for orange teriyaki chicken with some jasmine rice. Keep on watching and you see what I did. And if you, sorry, I got a text. If you would like to make it, let me know. Send me some pictures, follow me on my social medias and send me some pictures if you've made it. And let's get into it. Okay, so I don't know why I did that, and by the way, do not mind my nails. But right here, I'm just showing you the measurements of rice that I use. You can use white rice, brown rice, yellow rice, it doesn't matter. I chose to use jasmine rice because it tastes really good and it's not as sticky. So you just want to cut that off and you're going to see me switch to kitchen scissors because this knife and trying to cut it was just too much and I had a family size pack of chicken and I maybe probably used two and a half pieces. I'm not sure but it was a lot and using a knife to try to cut the fat off was just, it was just too much so use kitchen scissors if you have it. So I cannot remember if that's what it is or not, but we'll find out later. Then you're just going to cut it down the middle, and then what you're going to do after that is cut the chicken breast into strips, and then cut those strips in half. You're probably going to get about three to four strips, depending on how thick you cut it, and then cut it in half and shoot. video before I did the voiceover and the text I edited it on cute cut on my phone because I film on my phone so I just did that part on there and forgot that I cut on camera <laughs>
Okay, so after you get that all mixed up and set, you're going to take your baking sheet line with aluminum foil. bottom of the sheet. Right now I'm taking the frozen broccoli. I tried to break it up to see if it would because I didn't know that they were broccoli spears. That That's why I only got like one broccoli spear in each of my bowls. But I'm just placing it on the pan and one on one little side. I'm just putting it on the pan and I'm reaching in the bag because the bag is sitting on the chair. It was just not enough space for my setup and pain. It was just a lot. Same thing with the peppers and onions. These are pre-cut from Blue Lion. Just pop it right on the pan on one side. taking olive oil and some salt and pepper, putting it on the broccoli and peppers and onions and mixing it around just so they can have some type of seasoning. Mm -hmm. Another thing, if this voiceover sounds all over the place, it's because I'm not used to doing voice voiceovers yet, as you can tell just by that stutter. This is probably my third time doing a voiceover, and the last time I used this mic was with the Arabella hair review video, and the audio was cutting in and out. So, if that happens, I really do apologize. I will eventually get a better mic, get a better setup for voiceovers. just like this then add additional teriyaki sauce on top of everything pop it back in the oven for an additional 10 minutes just so that teriyaki sauce can you know sit and stick to the chicken and the veggies and I switched from this brand of teriyaki sauce to the food line brand because the food line brand is thicker and I didn't want to like too liquidy in the pan even though it happened anyway. This is the end result, you guys. There's my one little set broccoli spear, the peppers and onions, jasmine rice with extra teriyaki sauce mixture on top, the orange teriyaki chicken on the side. It tastes better than it looks. I'm telling you, it is really good. I didn't look at this recipe online. I came with it myself, but thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.